a man. No, a woman. Okay, wait. A bear is in the woods. Okay, is it taking a shit? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's what bears do in the woods. I mean, where famously, else? Where else are they going to do it? The Pope is Catholic, and uh-huh. the bears do that in the woods. Yes, yeah. I mean, has anybody ever given any thought as to why the cute little Charmin bears are the are the mascot for Charmin for toilet paper? It's because of the shitting. Okay, yeah. I I mean, I guess I never really thought that much about it. That right? makes sense. In the woods. Yeah, okay. Uh, but that's the thing. They don't shit in the woods. No, yeah. they have a nice little house with a pristine bathroom that Mama Bear probably oh, yeah. spends like every weekend scrubbing. It's you know? probably Goldilocks' house. No, because, no, she breaks into the bear's house. Oh. <sighs> That sucks. Yeah. (laughs) Okay, so the real question is, if you're three bears, who do you want breaking into your home, a man or a woman? Well, I mean, if it's a little girl, that's not so bad other than she's going to mess with all your stuff, apparently. She's going to eat your porridge. Yeah. Sit in your, sleep in your beds. Uh Uh-huh, and sit in your chairs. And sit in your chairs. Mm Mm-hmm. No, okay. The the thought experiment that's been going around the internet famously this past week is, if you're a woman, who would you rather encounter in the woods, mm-hmm. a man or a bear? I mean, I think I do agree with most women, and I would rather a bear because, you know, I, yeah. I went to girls camp. Like, I know some ways of, like, scaring away a bear. and st- Make yourself big. Right, right. And Don't then if run. That, and if that doesn't work, make yourself as small as you can and, like, curl <laughs> up in a little ball. Yeah. Um, and also, statistically speaking... It's way less likely for the bear to be on cocaine than for the man to be on cocaine. <laughs> I know there was that one cocaine bear, but there that's that one out one of how movie. many bears? <laughs> Based on a true story. <laughs> right, right. Right. <laughs> well, come on. I, this is obviously hyperbole. I mean, one's an apex predator and one's a bear. Oh, zing! <laughs> Funny. Now, that being said, if it's a mama bear and her cubs... I would much rather run into a dude. Okay. Yeah. Right. Yeah, you don't want to no. get in between Mm-mm. them. Mm-mm. Yeah. Mm. No, that would terrify me. I, and I th- and most although I would de- like here's the thing: if I knew death was imminent, I would absolutely try to pet one of those little cubs. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna get my pet in real quick. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Jump. <laughs> yeah. If Mama Bear is already hurtling toward me and there's no getting away, yeah. you better believe I'm gonna pet that little baby. <laughs> Listen, you can get your fix. A reminder: you can get your fix and pet the baby bear cubs at Yellowstone Bear World. You know, I actually We're did get to do that, that one year. My ex husband set that up for me, and it was so fun. But the picture they took of me made me look like a total moon face. It sucked. What's a moon face? Like my face just looks really white and flat and just it's just oh. not flattering. You know? They need to get better lighting in those. Yeah. Yeah, because that is a once in a lifetime memory. Right, right. To well, hold a bear. And not only that, but it was it was pretty expensive, you know, for the mm-hmm. entire 20 seconds that I got to hold the bear. Yeah. You know, I think it was like 60 or 70 bucks, mm-hmm. which is spendy for mm-hmm. 20 seconds. It is. But then on top of that, the picture I got was so crap, I can't <laughs> even display it. That's not fair. Right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I met a presidential candidate once and it, and it looked like it looked fake because the, <laughs> the picture was so what you said, flat. It looked like right. I was a cardboard cutout standing with another cardboard <laughs> cutout. That's funny. It's like, oh man, it's Mitt Romney. Anyway, <laughs> anyway, I I get it. Um, I think it's a sad commentary. Yeah, I would love to see more thought experiments that bring men together with women. You know, bring the sexes together rather right. than sort of prove the point that drives them apart. Except mm-hmm. maybe before we can come together, men need to understand that. Hey. You know, statistically speaking, mm-hmm. bad things can happen if you're alone in the woods with a man. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. But well, then again, I know plenty of men who are Caillou's dad. Right. You know? Right. Who were yeah, castrated this, like, at marriage. Yeah, being. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, right. I get that. So. Yeah. But then they have kids like Caillou, so you. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, that's sort of the thing, like... I think it's really important for men to be aware of their perception to women. And on top of that, too, like, I'd love to see what you're saying where we can, you know, bring the sexes together a little bit more. But I think that that can only really happen once, like, you know, domestic murder rates against women start going down. And actually, did you know that um, the highest killer of pregnant people is murder? 
Oh, geez. Yeah. Oh, like geez. It, yeah. Uh, if they're going to die while they're pregnant, that's probably what's going to kill them. S- since we're already talking <laughs> about murder, death, kill. Um, have oh, you yeah. seen the maid of honor toast to the bride at a wedding? She's like, cheers. And just remember, you're sitting right next to the person who is statistically <laughs> most likely to kill you. I have heard of that uh, one. And that's, yeah. Again, it's sad. It's not cool. It kind of makes me wonder if she it. just really hated the groom. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. Yeah. Or, or she just has a little gallows humor like we do on this show. <laughs> right, right. You know? Yeah. Should we have been saying unalived this whole time? I'm oh, so tired the, of... For the algorithm, probably. But hopefully this doesn't get nerfed. <laughs> the YouTube rules or whatever. Like, mm-hmm. like I'll watch network television. Mm-hmm. Stuff that kids can be watching. Right. And they don't use code words for stuff. Nope. 